So first of all, I will define what is the Grange interpolation formula. So let uh, y equal to f of x be a function, be a function which assumes, which assumes the values, the values f of x naught f f of x1 etc f of xn corresponding to the values corresponding to the values to the values x naught x1 etc up to xn where where values may not be may not be EQ distance or EQ space, EQ space. That means uh, X naught, uh, X one may not be equal to uh, the space between. That means X naught, X one, X two. This space is not may not be equal. May not be equal. Okay. In for Newton's forward and backward difference formula. The, they are EQ spaced, but in Lagrange's interpolation formula, it is not uh, uh, EQ spaced, may not be EQ spaced. Now, uh, the idea of interpolation is to for finding the value of function, we have to find a interpolating formula, uh, polynomial. So, now for Lagrange interpolation polynomial. Uh, the first, the linear, uh, please note down, the linear Lagrange interpolation form, interpolation polynomial is, is, or polynomial for the value, values. So, if you have given two values, x naught, f naught f naught means f of x naught and x naught x1 f1 if you have uh, given two values then we can find uh, a polynomial uh, lagrange linear interpolation polynomial is p1 of x its degree is 1 p1 of x is l naught f naught of x plus L1 F1 of X where I will define what is L0 and L1. So note that L0 is X minus X1 X0 minus X1 F0 plus L1 L1 means X minus X0 divided by in the denominator for l naught numerator there is no x naught terms but denominator this x naught so in l1 numerator there is no x1 term denominator it is x1 minus x f1 so that is the linear lagrange interpolation formula now and please note it down. Okay. Now, if we have given more than two values, second, the quadratic, the quadratic Lagrange, Lagrange, quadratic, quadratic polynomial is polynomial for the given values for the values so here we have given three values x naught f naught x1 f1 x2 f2 where f naught is actually f naught means f of x naught value of f at x naught Similarly, f1 is f of x1. So, here we have given three values. 
then the formula is uh, Lagrange interpolation formula p2 of x that means uh, degree of uh, this polynomial is 2 quadratic polynomial so uh, similarly l0 f0 plus l1 f1 plus l2 f2 now i will define what is l0 l1 and l2 so p2 of x is now here l0 is there is a since it is l0 there is no x0 terms in the numerator that is x minus x1 into x minus x2 x minus x1 into x minus x2 divided by and the denominators the starting point is x0 x0 minus x1 into x0 minus x2 f0 f0 plus l1 so there is no term x x1 term in numerator so x minus x0 into x minus x2 x minus x0 into x minus x1 divided by divided by x1 minus okay so here uh, l1 so x1 is the starting point x1 minus x0 into x1 minus x2 f1 plus similarly can you tell me what will be l3 l2 anybody so x this is minus x0 into x minus x1 x minus x0 into x minus x1 divided by x2 minus x0 x2 minus x0 into x2 minus x2 minus x1 x1 so now we can generalize uh, the uh, uh, Lagrange interpolation formula for uh, n polynomial of degree n okay so if you have given uh, if uh, we have given given uh, x0 f0 x1 f1 etc up to xn fn so if we have given n values then then the Lagrange interpolation formula Pn of x. So first I will write it is L0 F0 plus L1 F1 plus etc. Ln Fn. Now tell me what will be L0. L0 must be equal to there is no x0 term in the numerator so x minus x1 into how many terms are x1 x2 etc up to xn so x minus x2 into etc up to x minus xn divided by what will be the uh, in the numerator uh, denominator what will be x0 minus x1 okay x0 minus x1 x0 minus x2 into etc up to x0 minus x there is no x0 minus x0 x0 is there so uh, this mm, this is equal to into f0 now similarly what will be uh, l1 x minus l1 there is no x1 term in the numerator so x minus x0 into x minus x2 into etc up to x minus xn divided by in the denominator x1 minus x0 into x1 minus x2 
into etc up to x x1 minus xz f1 plus etc what will be the nth term ln x minus x1 sorry x minus x0 into x minus x1 into etc up to x minus xn minus 1 divided by xn minus x0 xn minus x1 etc up to xn minus xn minus 1 f so this is Lagrange interpolation formula for n n values so please note it down write this formula is very important so if we have given n values then you will get a n degree polynomial if you have given two values you will get a so if you have given n plus one values you will get a n degree polynomial if you have given two values you will get a linear polynomial so please note it down so you have to remember this formula so for numerical techniques uh, only thing you have to do is remember the formula so now we will uh, do problems the problems are very easy just we have to apply the formula okay so the first problem is the first problem is okay given given f of 2 is equal to 5 f of 2.5 is equal to 6 find the linear interpolating po polynomial using lagrange's formula and also find f of 2.2 so we have given uh, two values only two values so we we will get a linear lagrange linear polynomial so we have given given x naught is 2 right that means 2 5 and 2.5 6 is given so x naught f naught x1 f1 is given so x naught is 2 x1 is 2.5 f naught is equal to 5 f of x1 that is f1 is 6 and we know that a linear lagrange linear interpolating uh, polynomial is v1 of x equal to here we have given only two values so this is l naught x f of x naught or f naught plus l1 x f of x now you just to find out the uh, values Okay. L naught. You can separately find L naught. L naught is x minus x1 divided by x naught minus x1. So you will get x minus x1 is 2.5 divided by x naught is 2. 2 minus 2.5. 2 minus 2.5. Okay. So this is equal to minus 2 into x minus so x minus not point, uh, point zero 0.05 in the no, uh, denominator you will get in the numerator x2 2, 2 into minus 2.5. Similarly L1 of x l1 of x is x minus x naught divided by x1 minus x naught so x minus x naught x minus x naught is 2 divided by x1 is 2.5 minus 2 so you will get uh, x minus 2 divided by 1 by 2 that is 0 0.25 that is 2 in the x minus so we know that p1 of x is equal to l naught f naught plus l1 f1 so l naught is this 
this is L naught. So minus 2 into x minus 2.5 into f naught is 5 plus 2 into x minus uh, 6 is equal to 2.2x plus 1. Now you can write the uh, this is the formula. Now I have to find the value of value of f of 2.2. So I I replace x by 2.2. That is minus 2 into uh, 2.2 minus 2. Point, okay, so I I I, I will. Uh, So I will uh, I, I have to find out f of 2.2. So I will apply here minus 2 into 2.2 minus 2.5 into 5 plus 2 into 2.2 minus 2 into 6. This is equal to so this is uh, actually uh, to minus okay minus two into two point two into two point five is minus zero point uh, three plus plus two into two point two into sorry zero point two into six. So the value is, I think, in the region is. Let us check the value. The so two into zero point three, which is equal to zero point two two into zero point three is zero point six plus. Sorry, into. Okay. Zero into five is there. So zero point six into five is equal to three. So that is value is three plus plus two into zero point two into six two point four two point so the answer is five point. So this is the. So anybody have any doubt? So let us move to next problem. So this is also a similar problem. So uh, compute, compute log 9.2 from log 9 which is equal to 2.1972 log 9.5 which is equal to 2.2513 and log 2.3979 using Lagrange quadratic interpolation so here we have given three values so first one is x naught x naught is this 0 0.9 and x1 is this 0. Point, sorry 9.5 x naught is 9 x1 is 9.5 and x3 is x2 is 11 and we have f of x is log x3 so f of x1 is log x1 which is log 9.5 5 it's given as 2.2513 similarly f of x2 or f2 is log 11 2.3979 okay and also you have given f of f naught f naught is not written here so f naught is f of x naught which is equal to 2.1972 the three values are given so we we have to find out uh, p 
2 of x which is l naught f f naught plus l1 f1 plus l2 f2 so first we will find what is l naught okay l naught the formula for finding l naught is x minus x1 into x minus x2 divided by x naught minus x1 into x naught minus x2. So you can write it as x minus 9.5 into x minus 11 divided by 9 minus 9.5 into 9 minus 11. So we have to calculate this value. log 9.1 so l naught of 9.2 is actually we will replace x by 9.2 okay have you got it so if i want to find the p2 of 9.2 i want l naught of 9.2 into f naught plus l1 of 9.2 l1 of 9.2 into f2 plus l2 of 9.2 into f2, f2 is f1 so that is 9.2 minus 9.5 into 9.2 minus x2 is 11 divided by x0 minus x1 that is 0. Point, mm, so this is 0. Point minus 0. 0.5 9 minus 11 is minus 2 so that is, if you calculate this you will get 0. 0.54 next we will find out l1 of x the formula is you, you should write this formula x minus x naught into x minus x2 x1 minus x naught into x1 minus x2 which is equal to x minus 9 into x minus 11 divided by 9.5 minus 9 into 9.5 minus 11. So L1 of 9.2 is 9.2 minus 9 into 9.2 minus 11 divided by 0 0.5 into 0 0.1 minus 1.0.4. 0 .4. Similarly, similarly, you find out what is L no L2 of x. So just apply the formula and just calculate what is L2 of 9.2. So the value is minus 0 0.0. Now, now just we will apply it in the formula. We will get the answer. So uh, log 9.2 is L naught of 9.2 into f of x naught plus L1 of 9.2 into f, f of x1, L2 of 9.2 into f of x. So L naught of uh, 9.2 is 0 0.54 into f naught is given 2.1972 plus L1 of 9.2 is 0 0.48 into 2.2513 and plus what is plus 0 point minus 0 point 0 0.02 into okay. so the value is uh 2.1219 now we will calculate the error there is exact value minus approximate value so the exact value is uh, actually this is from the calculator you can find this exact value minus the actual uh, approximate value so the error is 0 0.000035 so it is sufficient for four decimal place accuracy okay similarly uh, i will give a question so please do this problem And this is your homework. Uh, 
I will uh, share this question in your WhatsApp. So these are uh, 